sex education is introduced mm. in schools and in mm. the syllabus good touch bad touch all these things are now taught to children i don't think i would be able to do um something that's super bold myself mm. and but i think last story is just um finally had people see me and take me seriously as an actor because after saif ali khan and awazuddin and all these people they they being yeah, part of it so it's like Uh, it has like open, top, open, top, top league is 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 part of it. So it's, it it just literally opens up the entire. And it paradigm. reaches a much wider it's a, audience. It's a much, it's a it's a much bigger Which audience. Is, yeah. Um, Hi, I'm Kiara Advani, and you're watching me on Bollywood Hangama. <laughs> Now, in a country of 1.3 billion people, why do you think that uh, it's such a repressed society that we have, and we we are even we have to think twice before talking about sexuality and anything that that is remotely anything to do with uh, because everything we want to be hidden actually you know you should yeah. not be talking about it why is it That's that true. that we are such a repressed society? I think there's lack of education. Right? Mm. It boils down to that ultimately. Mm. I mean, it's only been in the past couple of years that like sex education is introduced mm. in schools and in mm. the syllabus. Good touch, bad touch, all these things are now taught to children. Earlier mm. it was always there was a certain age, there was everything you know, the birds mm. and bees were not spoken about. It's weird to talk about it to your parents. Mm. Today, you're realizing that you know we need to educate our kids about it, or we need everyone should be aware of of everything mm. before um, you know uh, going into it. So yeah, I think um, mm. with education that will change. Mm. Okay, and um, do you have this apprehension that after this? Um, that there can be any some sort of stereotyping happening with Kiara Advani in terms of that more such roles coming in, coming your way that is that <laughs> I haven't got any offers like mm. that but I think uh, Mega was really innocent so mm. there's that innocence that kind Me, of innocent to aapko lag raha hai na matlab but but the fact is that the way uh, the, the one of the reasons why people are watching because they they're watching so the fact is that even this industry in many ways it it works like that 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 people uh, they have those those apprehension that those those anticipation that maybe like uh she she can uh, she's good for because now they have seen your expressions as well yeah but i so, i mean like for me i'm i'm somebody who there's certain kind of roles that i would want to do and sometimes i wouldn't want to do mm. um and i don't think so i mean whatever i've been getting right now the kind of roles coming my way or the directors who who appreciated my work after seeing last stories is everyone i really want to work with mm. so it's exciting definitely there's some interesting scripts that i've read mm. um and no i don't think so i don't think that stereotype will happen because i don't think uh, i think i think that there's somewhere through that also that that little girl next door thing comes out it's not mm. it's I I don't think I would be able to do um something that's super bold myself mm. and but um but I, yeah it's it's I don't think I hope not I really mm. I don't think so it's not happened you're saying it I don't know why but nobody else has No we, you you never know you know this this is our because of whatever experience that we have so we've seen a lot of these things this ha- happening so that is why just, uh, of, of yeah, it, it it always things, happens yeah. actually it always does Fortunately it's mm. not fortunately it's not in this mm. case mm. So, yeah. okay um and considering that that uh, you've been part of this um, um dharma productions uh, uh production and uh, directed by karan johar so um you know suddenly there's there's a different sort of interest in uh, in any actress whatsoever that what next because mm. if if karan johar is saying yes to her so then th- what is the future course of action as far as she is concerned uh, do you do you feel those vibes in terms of uh, the changing perception as far as the industry is concerned um because you know doing a fugly and a, th- then doing a film with karan johar it, it becomes different you're right the absolutely that you have and all those things um i think um i don't know what the future holds mm. i hope it's good it's been good till now the graph has been on a steady upward slope jee, jee. slowly slowly but it's going up and that's the exciting part of it cuz i mean every day is a new adventure honestly mm. but i think last story is just um finally had people see me and take me seriously as an actor mm. and in fact that's exactly what karan had told me when he called me to offer me the part he said he said what i what and he was confident about this before anybody you know before any of the reviews came out jee, he jee, said jee. that um, it will show your potential as an actor because it's completely driven the main protagonist is megha and it's from her point of view and of course the critics everything i mean it's been so overwhelming i didn't i didn't realize it would get, get me this kind of appreciation um mm. in this role but i think it's been one of the most liberating films i've ever done it's mm. it's something that was extremely new and different for me mm. and um i hope i hope the future has some exciting um plans in store 
Okay, uh, now what about uh, the web medium? Because um, obviously this is anyway is like a web medium yeah. that, that you've already experimented with and it is uh, hugely successful because yeah. everyone is talking about it. Now, apart from uh, last story is another big uh, thing that Sacred has happened games. in Net Netflix is Sacred Games and um, they are the actors and the actresses. They are literally pushing the envelope as far as expressing themselves, be it Absolutely. the language, be it the, uh, the physical intimacy and the entire works. Um, how do you look uh, as far as uh, Nikia Radwani is concerned in terms of the, how willing uh, are you to just uh, push the envelope if the context is demand, demand something like that? Um, how willing am I to push the envelope, mm. envelope or how willing am I to do a web series or something? Not, not web series, in terms of say uh, Sacred Games apart from the fact that you know, it's it's going with the context. Yeah, I feel okay. You mean that. you mean like the creative liberty yeah. while we? Did. I think that's a very personal thing at the end mm. of the day. And I think mm. if you're not comfortable doing it, then then you it won't work mm. because you won't be able to do it with conviction. Jee, jee. So I think there is there is an, um, you know a certain line that everyone draws from myself where they are okay doing and mm. or you know they feel that this is how much they would uh, be willing or not willing to mm. what they believe in or they don't. So I'm I don't know. I think. Um, uh, I want to do something very like if I had to do a web series, I want to do something that's like I binge watch a lot of web shows and a lot mm -hmm. of um, international web shows. Even in fact, I love Sacred Games. And but then there are a lot of these these binge watching ones, like the ones like you know the girly ones and like a couple of friends and things G. like that. G. So I don't know. I think um, uh, whenever that happens, I don't know if I if right now is the time I would want to do um, a web series, but. Because I think you're also playing a character for a very long time. Mm. So that is something I don't know if I, I want to do at this point. Um, movies but primarily. Yeah, movies primarily right now. I mean, at least you... I think when you do a web show, there is there is a fixed amount of uh, a year. They have that thing, right? That you... That, like you're stuck in that character. So. I, I don't think so. Because so, and, and these days they can, they can shoot quite quickly. So I think it's so. a lot of factors. It depends mm. on a lot of mm. factors. I haven't mm. thought it through completely. But um, right now the focus is mm. films. Yeah, because after Saif Ali Khan and Awazuddin and all these people, they're, they're being yeah. part of it. So it's like, uh, yeah, it's like it's open, top, it's top, top league is, is, is part of it. So it, it, it just literally opens up the entire... And it paradigm. reaches a much wider it's a, audience. It's a much, it's a, it's a much bigger Which audience. Is, yeah. uh, both, so, I mean, both in India as well as abroad for that matter. It's, it's, a, it's a massive audience. Yeah. Yes, there's no doubt about that. Hi, I'm Kiara Advani and you're watching me on Bollywood Hangama.